that calls this a heavyweight championship fight Ready? defines itself, but that doesn't mean it can't be a good fight. Here is bent strong enough to handle Morrison's power. And the early returns say no. If Morrison can control his first. Oh, Tommy stuns by right hand, and down goes Morrison. He has been plagued by a weak chin. The crowd a little bit. Now we saw Morrison go down, knock down rule in a box. Michael Bent on the verge of a big moment, and he's got it. That's it. A first round KO for Michael Bent. And Tommy Morrison's eight million dollar payday. The winner by TKO and new WBO heavyweight champion of the world, Michael. Vladimir Klitschko seems so perfect, you wonder what's wrong with him. Can Corey Sanders find out? says, in the heavyweight division, you cannot take a risk. Difficult for Vladimir to get the jab in. Hard left hand by Corey Sanders. Left hook lands for Klitschko, right hand to the bottom. Hit with a good solid punch by a good puncher. He hits hit again. He's bent, lowering his height some more. And Klitschko goes down on a huge left hand inside by Corey Sanders. Right on the eyebrow. Long time to go in the round. Vladimir down a second time. And bust, if he go down again, although the clock... Rachman was able to do in this situation. He was able to come back and knock Sanders out. Goes down a third time. Sanders is hitting him with. And he's attacking to try to get out of trouble instead of holding. And this is not going to go well. Another knockdown. The fourth time. And the referee, Gennaro Rodriguez, stops the fight. And well, the one thing that was unknown about Vladimir coming into this fight was what would happen if he got tagged by a legitimate puncher. Now we know. The defending champion has home advantage, he's got height and reach advantage, and is unbeaten, whereas the challenger has got five defeats on his record. Lennox Lewis, the champion, making his fourth defense of the title he won in perhaps some uh, controversial circumstances, but he's defended successfully three times. The armory, but there's plenty more still there, one suspects. And Lewis, Lewis unbeaten, remember, after 25 fights. Oh, he's got him! Oh, Lewis walked into a right hand, and that was the sucker punch that they worried about. And Lewis staggers decided it's all over my goodness what an upset and Lennox Lewis's career must now be in tatters and the father of six children the 29 year old from Chicago has done what nobody has ever done before and has stopped Lennox Lewis and what a time to do it he wins coming by way of knockout one loss 39 knockouts he has established his place in the history books as the youngest man to win the heavyweight title. For the bow. Oh, 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 overachieving warrior. Oh, there he is. Oh, down goes Tyson. Evander Holyfield is letting it all hang out. They can pick it up by the left. Oh, a straight right combination by Holyfield. Holyfield. Holyfield's on the road. He's taking a shot. He's going for it. Tyson, looking to put Tyson.
unbelievable thing I've ever been privileged to witness. It is Bedlam! The high-spirited crowd is on hand to watch Floyd Patterson defend his heavyweight title against Sweden's Ingemar Johansson. American fans get their first look at Johansson, 26-year-old European champion. For Patterson, it's an old story as he prepares for his fifth title defense. The champion is a 5-1 to one favorite. Floyd comes out of his shell to throw. Johansson throws. Ingo scores with an unusual combination. A lift hook to the jaw, and there's that pointed right to the head, and the champion is down. Tony's corner. And there he goes again. Johansson as he senses victory. The referee Ruby Goldstein stops it. It's all over. Ingemar Johansson is the winner. In two minutes and three seconds of the third round, Patterson, knocked out for the first time in his career, has been on the canvas seven times. Ingemar Johansson becomes the first Scandinavian-born fighter ever to hold this most important of all boxing titles. No fear in either man. There is no fear in George Foreman. He's grown enormously in his Confident evening. Frazier quite understandably the favorite. Foreman comes out punching with the right. This tremendous fighter. A I think he hurt Joe Frazier. I think Joe is hurt. Next to me is saying it. You may hear him. Down goes Frazier. Down goes Frazier. A heavyweight champion is taking the mandatory eight counts as poised as can be. We have a minute left in this. The excitement here that we look for. Frazier is dead. You see the countdown now. Foreman has not panicked. Foreman is going about his... Foreman is all over Joe Frazier. Frazier is down again, and he may be... No, he is rising. He is dead. He is about to end. Two knockdowns in the first round of Joe Frazier. Down again. No saving by the bell. Martha Mercani. Oh, he is all over Frazier again. He has Frazier in the corner. His, Frazier's knees buckled. He is about, he is down. He, in the Mexico City arena, a quick left from George. Another, Frazier is down for the fifth it time. Target track. Frazier is ready to go again. Joe is standing, there he goes. Three times, three times. The fight is stopped. Angie Dundee is screaming, stop it. It is over, it is over. George Foreman is the heavyweight champion of the He's world. Record, 34 wins, two losses, 28 wins by way of knockouts. His record of 38 wins, one loss, one draw, 29 wins by way of knockout. The undisputed heavyweight champion of the world. And what, what you're good at? Right hand, left to rock. And Lewis. He can. Left puts at or below his waist. Good fights like this. He performs a little better than you to the ropes. It can't. Rockman, jab, 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 jab. Four of them lost the ring. <laughs> is a fight to go with those as one of the four biggest upsets in the history of the heavyweight division. 29 wins, four defeats, one loss, one draw, with 19 wins by way of knockout. His outstanding record, 37 wins, no defeats, with 33 big wins by way of knockout. The undefeated, undisputed, 
heavyweight champion of the world. Mike didn't have that menacing look that we've seen in so many of his fights before. Coming up to the closing seconds of this, the first one. Wow! With the right hand is Buster Douglas. Oh, look at this! Buster landing some shots! Thought uh, we might not see. Hey, there's a grazing right hand gets through. Oh, an uppercut gets through. Buster Douglas has landed over 50 punches in Tyson from Mike Tyson. Oh, that man! Keep him off. Tyson. You see, oh, there's Mike missing that big left. And look at this, the first two big shots. And Mike wants to drag this uh, into some... Oh, if, if, if two, three, and all of that sort of stuff. But remember that all night. Oh, that's a nice uppercut that time. The drops Buster Douglas. The count's up to two and three. All right. And the count. And he comes with the uppercut. Somehow or other, Buster's throwing shots back. Look at this. Now nine, and I expected Mike. Look at this. I haven't seen Mike in this kind of trouble before. Look, Buster's landing these. Oh, nice uppercut by Buster Douglas. Look at this. He's knocked Mike Tyson down for the first time in his career. He may not be able to recover. It's up to seven and eight. He's not going to make it. Unbelievable. 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 Buster Douglas is a new heavyweight champion of the world. It's a B, one of the biggest. Upsets in the history of boxing.